Hey, once again, the world's number one problem gambling interventionist here with a special micro video dedicated for you if you're married to a problem gambler. If your hobby is a problem gambler, this message is for you. Please stay with me. I've got a great call to action at the end of this video. And I believe that with the information that I'm gonna give you is gonna be very useful, not just for a lifetime, which is great, but for right now immediately take action. And by the way, if you're not soldier scribed, I'm going to ask you to soldier scribe and support me. I need to reach young women, young men, older, older men, older ladies. Would you help me save souls out of the fire, bring them out and bring them into a no a permanent no gambling zone? Would you do that for me? Share this video. Please share this video and make sure that you look below before you walk away. There's going to be some great information down below. The, the, the wife of the problem gambler and is in, is in hot water facing multiple counts of lying, uh, inaccountability. You know what it's like, right? When the husband says that, He's gonna be there and he's not. You find him lying. You find your finances are at stake. Make you a little bit worried. What does that do to you? There's a host of experiences that you will go grow, either grow through or go through if you're married to a problem gambler. Now, what I'm gonna share with you is how you can best effectively manage the situation. You can adapt and improvise to this situation because if you don't you're gonna, you're gonna fall into a deep depression either a deep depression your finances are going to be affected and as i mentioned earlier your inner peace your inner peace right your inner confidence that anchor that you have inside maybe it's not really solid but now it's time and you're feeling it i gotta build my anchor so that i can get through this journey this experience that i'm going through this environment that we're in you know you can be in an environment but the environment does not have to be in your mind okay keep that and keep that in mind with you please stay with me i promise i'm going to be very quickly here in this micro video but you're facing a lot of different uh maybe negative opportunities because you you can fall into depression you can fall into a further sin you can be you can even you might even feel lonely and might be tempted to seek out another man only to speak with but yet you know that when we do these kinds of things it's easy for us to fall into other sins this is the situation that you're facing and i'm going to be very blunt with you because you need to you need to see the enemy um your relationship can begin deteriorating especially if you have great love uh, you, you, you have to protect your marriage, your finances, you'll notice relationships. And again, all of these things that your husband may be doing or is doing, and you're not too sure because he's away from you most of the time, will impact you in many different ways. Because we're all different, we're all unique. I can't pinpoint everything that you're going through or what you would go through. But I will say this, there'll be a lot of collateral damage if you don't anchor down or hunker down like they say and start really working and making sure that your foundation is solid. Because you may want to go through this journey. It may be quick. It may be a bit, little bit longer than you expected. So your main your main goal is obviously to maintain your inner peace, your inner focus, your inner so that you can have creativity, so that you can have confidence to make the decisions that you need to do to take action upon the life hacks that you need to implement in your life today, now, so that you can be strong. So that no matter what happens, you never know. We never know what may happen tomorrow. Um, and again, please stay with me because there's going to be a great call to action at the end of this video. And by the way, gambling is a lie. Gambling is a lie. And if you're appreciating this mission, I'm going to ask you to support me. Share this video. Please share this video. Make sure that you leave a comment. So what do we do? I mean, there's so many things that, that you, there, there, there may be things right now that you might be facing that nobody else knows. You might feel totally isolated alone. Well, you're not alone. 
You're not alone. You're in good company right now. This is a great environment. I'm sure that you, you can feel the energy because I was a problem gambler. And yes, I've been married. So I have an idea of what it is that you're going through. But I'll tell you, freedom and having creativity and confidence and inner peace is, is it. That's what will lead you in all these other areas and will give you, will sustain you, will be like an anchor. Help you to stay creative because, boy, you need to be creative in these situations. To counter some of these things, or if not all of them. I know that your situation is difficult. It's tough. Santos, you may not know. Oh, believe me, I do know. I may not be in your shoes, but I've been there and I've done that. Here's my recommendation, and I want to thank you for hanging out with me. Number one, you need to belong to a community somewhere. I'm inviting you to be a part of the Soldiers of Self Mastery community. My mission is a million souls out of the fire into a no, a no, a permanent no gambling zone. NGZ, right? No gambling zone. Permanent. Permanent, man. That's freedom. Number one, within community, there's accountability, there's support, there's tools. And there's also a partnership because you don't want to really be alone through this. You don't want to be alone unless you're superwoman. Of course, women are very strong. They're very, women are resilient. Very, you are very resilient. You're creative and you're bold, but all of that can dwindle down, right? So your candle fire needs to stay lit and I'm here to help you keep it lit. Number two, and below is the information, as I mentioned in the description area, there is a video, the Betty White story. Man, I've watched that video numerous times. And every time that I watch it, I get more out of it. Please watch. She was not a gambler, but she was married. And look at her life and what she did and what she went through. Hopefully you're not there, but Betty White is a tremendous educational video. And I'm gonna invite you to watch it, click below. So with that said, once again, Santos Jr., the world's number one problem gambling interventionist, founder, and I'm going to see you at the top on the inside of my very next one, making every day super fantastic, terrific, and over the top, in spite of and because of.